Jesus says, my kingdom is like what happens to the mustard seed. Jesus says, I can take the smallest of persons. I can take the worst of sinners. I can take the most discouraged of people. And when my grace gets working in their life, you watch what happens. That little mustard seed, that little bit of faith, all it takes is a little bit of faith this morning. You don't have to have it all put together to see God work in your life. And you can be at the bottom. That's when God does His best work. God does His best work not when you're at the top, but when you're at the bottom. Not when you're full of hope, but when you're hopeless. Jesus says, I can take a little mustard seed and turn it into a tree. Are you ready for this? This is the coolest part about this verse. Notice this. That, that He doesn't end with just that it's a tree. He says that it's a tree that birds are going to use to rest. you ready for what this means for your life? All right, I'm going to use a cheesy pastor line. God will take your test and turn it into a testimony. Here's what that means. The smallest of you, the person with the most problems in the room right now, with the greatest suffering in the room right now, here's how good God's promises are in your life. God doesn't just promise that He's going to make it better. He does that. He makes an even better promise. He says, I'm going to take your deepest mess. I'm going to take the worst part of you that you're embarrassed to even talk about, and I'm going to use it to bless other people. How cool is that? That's worth getting excited about as a church family, that God will take that thing that you're most ashamed about, that you never wanted to talk about, and He'll make it a message for the world to hear. That's what He does. That's what He's doing right now in our world. It's the great hope of the gospel.